Sometimes the best way to do that is with a timeout. They look um, to be overwhelmed right now. Changes for Boston. Robert Sacre, he's checked in for Pleiss. And Curry subbed in for Clay Anthony early. Boston leading by eight. Curry dishes to Harris. Offensive rebound. Second shot opportunity. The shot will not go. One for five on offense. A slow start here in the second half. Out of bounds, Boston takes possession. Clark, one thing we've seen from these guys is excellent ball movement. And you love to see that, Kevin. I mean, I love watching unselfish play, and I know Greg enjoys that, too. No doubt about it. It's fun to watch the way they're operating as a team right now. They are all in sync. The three from Chalmers, and Boston with the rebound. Sacre has got his fourth rebound in this one. You've got to give them a lot of credit for the job they've done on the backboard. They've done a lot of things well today, but really it's about what they've done on the backboard that's at the top of that list. And the dunk by Walker. No doubt that is within his range. Well, I would hope so. He's a pro and it was only a one-footer. Come on now. You know, he just like every other coach he can when the defense gives up points on the inside. And boy, are they struggling in there. Yeah, well, they're getting pummeled in there. So you've got to figure out a way to make some adjustments to try to change that around. And that's why he needed the timeout. You know what? They just are in a funk right now offensively. A good time. to maybe come and come up with a play to get them a good look. Well, most coaches, you know, usually have a, a go-to speech or tactic that they can um, use when they need it most. So we'll see if that's the case here. Nogueira, he's checked in for Henry Walker. A little over two and a half minutes off the clock in this final half of play. It'll go. The Boston lead is... Cut to just nine on the basket from Chalmers. And he got loose from the three-point range in the first half and showing signs here that he's still got the flow in the second. And that's just carelessness there. I mean, you have got to have your head in the game. Austin making a switch here. Rozier's checked in. Got that one up quick. They're going back to the three-point shot over and over and over. And they may have found the Achilles heel of this defense. That was their ninth straight point from beyond the arc. They push it up for on three. Brown with it. Picked up by Harris. Chalmers against Curry. The screen from Brown. The three from Chalmers. Curry with the defensive effort. Finish off the break. Curry's got four this quarter. Their interior defense has been dismal. Yeah, they're losing the battle in the paint. Chalmers' shot is no good. Now, they've been outstanding on the boards, and it's a big reason why they've got a lead. Doing the dirty work down low. We call that a collabo because everybody's boxing out and making sure they secure the glass. Harris. Offensive rebound. And the shot is good. Sacre's got his first points of the game. That's the third bucket in a row from the paint. 
This defense needs to clog those lanes in the middle much more effectively. You just cannot allow the offense to have that quality of a look each and every possession. His shooting has been outstanding. You're definitely one of the reasons they're up in this game. The three from Chalmers. Shot is no good. Now Boston takes it the other way. 17 points. Oh! And it's all one-way traffic tonight. Boy, they have been lights out offensively. <laughs> and there's no telling how big that lead's going to get. But, again, it's just one game. But, nonetheless, a very impressive one, the way they've handled their business here. Here's Harris. Harris missing again. He's been wayward and just off on about everything he's put up in this period. And here's Brown outside. The shot is off. Curry. It could go. And as we end the third quarter, a double-digit deficit will make it tough to come back. Austin on top as they end the period on a 9-0 run. And we're getting underway here in the fourth quarter. The scoreboard tells the story in this matchup. But we'll see how much things change up here. Boston leading by 15. And Mario Chalmers gets the whistle that time. That is his first foul of the game. Rozier is out there with Young. And it's Price in at center. That's the Boston five. Not too much respect shown to him by the defenders. to answer back but that three is off the mark and a big lead for them on both the scoreboard and the backboard thus far yeah rebounding has been a big key in this one greg they've asserted their will and have taken control on the glass dishes it to mcdaniels expanding his range and he gets it to go man they came Ooh. out smoking here from beyond and Greg, as hot as they are from out there, absolutely no reason at all not to just keep letting them fly. And there's the feet to Chalmers. A little over a minute of the fourth quarter gone right now. Shoots. Price with the rebound. Price has got his third rebound tonight. Young left side. Great pass to set up the lay-in. They're forcing the ball inside, and it's working beautifully. It, it really is. Five out of six of their last field goals have come from the paint. Yeah, saw some things that just weren't working for them and wants to make some adjustments. Yeah, and no reason to wait around to do that, Greg. I mean, you might as well make those adjustments right away. Gerald Wallace, he's checked in for Boston. Shot by Odin is no good. Rare you'll see him miss such an open look. And the shot is good. And it's eight points for Wallace. And you're not going to pass up that kind of look. The three. Walker with the rebound. Walker's got his fourth rebound in this one. Young's shot is off. Just not there from a rhythm standpoint right now. It's really eluding him. And let's quickly check out the scoring breakdown here for, for Boston. Guys, the passing we've seen from them has been tremendous. Very unselfish. Yeah, but they've also done a great job of playing in space. Getting out in transition every opportunity. That's also good. So he hits both free throws. Boy, a perfect half at the free throw line for him. That'll help their comeback effort for real. And, Clark, those free throws need to continue if they're going to get back in this game. Well, I think the defense got lucky right there. I mean, he's going to make a lot more of those than he misses when he's got that much room. There's been a change in his game compared to what we saw in the first half. I mean, he's scoring with a lot of confidence now. Releases. Rejected by Walker. And that one goes out of bounds. Last touch by Walker.
Just a little under two and a half minutes have passed now here in the fourth. The three from Chalmers. And good on the basket. Book it. Chalmers has got 28. He's absolutely killing it from outside. And he clearly doesn't like what's going on out there right now. Would you? I mean, how could he like what's happening? Really had to take a time out there and try to figure out a way to derail their momentum. Now a timeout called by Boston. some information for us, Doris. Thank you, Kevin. Brad Stevens had some words for his team over the break. He said, we are this close to finishing them off, but the job is not done yet, and I don't want to see any let up out there. We'll see how well his point got across, guys. Thank you, Doris. Not his best game, but they're still getting it done collectively. Stolen by Walker. Here's Young. Rips down the breakaway slam. Oh, quick hands <laughs> on the steal and then just mad hops on the slam. Great sequence for them defensively and Clark offensively. Well, one usually leads to the other, Kevin. That's just good aggressive attacking basketball at both ends. And here's Chalmers for three. Tries again. And he sinks the layup. And it's still a close game. I mean, despite the fact that they've struggled to compete on the boards. Yeah, you know, but down the stretch here, guys, they'll summon that extra effort to try and get it done, I think. Over to the wing. Fires the three. That drops. That gives him his second three of the half with three total for the game. Wallace misses. And here's the fast break. Here's the three. And that one's good. Well, I tell you what, getting out in transition has really been a big part of this run they're on now. And, and the best way to pile up points in a hurry, just run and get your buckets before the defense can get set. And it's on its way from Chalmers for two. And he overshot that one, missing. Here's Rozier. Oh, took the contact and tried to throw it down over the top, but instead he'll shoot free throws. And that's really just smart basketball. You send a poor foul shooter to the line. Yeah, and he was on his way to sending that one down, so the play is definitely to foul right there, which he did. Tobias Harris has checked in for Gerald Wallace. And the three off target. And so it's Boston with it. Earlier in the game, they had a 19-point lead. Is it getting dark in here? Because if not, it's time to turn the lights out. <laughs> They're out already. I mean, give them a ton of credit for the job they did here today. Really impressive. To the middle. Walker the pass to Young. The quick look no good that time. There's a four-second difference from the shot clock to the game clock. Chalmers' shot is no good. And he's really having all sorts of problems with his jumper right now. Yeah, big time. I mean, the words that come to mind, ice and cold and disappearing stroke, all with a plot. That free throw good from Walker. And so Walker nails both of them. And they go to the intentional foul. Yeah, not sure what that was about. I mean, talk about a brain cramp. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, completely a brain fade. I don't know where that came from. Just lost sense of time and the situation. And you know what? That's one of those heat checks. <laughs> He's taking shots like that. Yeah, heat check or not, I don't care how hot he may or may not be. He's not making that one. And so it's Boston easily grabbing this one. Even early on in this one, it seemed like they were happy to be playing at home. 